Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you a game between Alexander Lehin and Clarence Howell. This game was played in Madrid in 1923. Clarence Howell was a very strong chess player. He was New York State Champion. And in this game, he was lucky to have black pieces. Alehin started with d4. Howell played d5. c4, c6, going for Slav defense. Knight to c3, knight to f6. e3, e6, knight to f3, knight from b to d7, bishop to d3. This is, even today, the main line. Black to move. D takes on c4 is the most played move today. Howell played bishop to d6, e4, threatening e5, d takes on e4, knight takes on e4, knight takes knight, bishop takes knight, knight to f6 attacking the bishop, bishop to c2, the best spot for the bishop, b6 intending, bishop to b7 and c5, Alehin castle kingside, bishop to b7, queen to e2, queen to c7, bishop to d2, and after black castles kingside, bishop to c3. But it was a surprise. Instead of castling kingside, how well castled queenside? Perhaps he didn't like his position after castling kingside. Bishop to c3, perhaps rook from a to d8, rook from a to d1. Hmm. Okay. How well cast at queenside? And now, no hesitation. b4. And this already looks scary. Knight to g4. Attacking h2 pawn. Provoking white to advance a pawn in front of the king. Which pawn to advance? Alehin played g3, the best move, better than h3. c5, b takes on c5, b takes on c5, rook from a to b1, knight to f6, d takes on c5, bishop takes on c5, bishop to f4, attacking the queen. Howell has a hard time. Bishop to d6, knight to e5, but now g5. Did Alehin miss this move? If bishop moves, if bishop takes on g5, bishop takes on e5. We have reached the most critical position of the game. Why to move? What would you do? Please pause the video and find the best move for white. What did you find? Alexander Alehin sacrificed the exchange. c5 was also promising. Black to move. King takes on b7. If queen takes on b7, bishop takes on g5, bishop takes on e5, queen takes bishop. So we have king takes on b7. Rook to b1 check. King to c8. Why to move? How would you continue now? Alehin played c5. This is the annihilation of the defense. The c pawn is extremely poisoned. Even after the game, they had to decontaminate it. Just kidding. They chucked the pawn in the bin. Rook to d7. If bishop takes on c5, queen to a6 check, queen to b7, queen takes queen check mate. And if queen takes on c5, queen to a6 check, king to c7, queen to b7 check mate. Howell played rook to d7, making the room for the monarch to escape. Queen to a6 check, king to d8, white. Play the move and black resigned. The move is 
dubious man. C takes on d6. Black resigned in view of this continuation. H6. Hmm. Let's try a better one. Rook takes on d6. Knight takes on f7, forking the king and two rooks. Queen takes knight. Queen takes rook check. Knight to d7 and now in a slow motion. Rook to b8. Check. Mate. What a game. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess. And bye for now.